What's up, Gemini Cross Watchers? It's West Coast Tarot with your May. What is my Gemini up to? This is for my lovely Cross Watchers of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is a general reading and may not resonate with every Gemini out there. Um, but this is for those who are in a connection with a Gemini. Maybe you're not talking or maybe you're just wondering what they're up to. This is the video for the cross watchers. Gemini, you can watch too, but therefore you are cross watching. <laughs> but you're more than welcome to watch if you want to as well, okay? Because energies can be reversed. Also, if you do want a personal reading with me or if you're interested in any of the decks that I use, all that information can always be found down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe if I vibed with you, okay? All right, Spirit, what is Gemini up to for the month of May? What is Gemini up to for the month of May? I do read reversals too, so if you don't like reversals, I'm not the channel for you. So we have three of spears, ace of spears in reverse. And three of cups, ace of cups in reverse, knight of spear, I'm um, king of spears, excuse me, temperance, wheel of fortune in reverse, six of cups, and ten of cups in reverse. Okay, so right now, um, Let's start into the recent past. I definitely feel like there was something that this Gemini was planning, okay? I feel like they were looking ahead. They wanted to grow in their life. It could have been with a person, but there was something that they wanted to plan for the future. You know, I feel like they made a choice, and they were waiting to see if that plan would work out. With the Ace of Spears here in reverse, though, I feel like it didn't. Um, I feel like... I feel like it. the energy wasn't returned. The passion wasn't returned. And I definitely feel like there was a situation that just became chaotic, okay? I feel like, you know, a lot of them may not have had the truth um, to a situation, um, but I feel like they were confused. And it definitely could have been linked to a third-party situation. Um, now, keep in mind, third-party situation is not always in regards to love. It could be at work. It could be friendships, family, etc. But I definitely am getting the feeling that this is a love situation, okay? So I feel like they may have been planning with the person um, that was in a third-party situation or they were in a third-party situation. But whatever it is, I feel like the situation was cut out, okay? Um, it was cut out. There was a lot of untruth truthfulness here there was a lot of known and I feel like um, this Gemini still would like to reconnect with this person is what I'm feeling um, I definitely get the feeling that this Gemini would like to reunite with this person or wanted to re reunite with this person spirit why is the three of, swords, of spears here why is this here for my Gemini's yeah um, a lot of you could have been connecting with an Aries. What's up, Aries? Um, but there was a situation that was not balanced out. It wasn't stable. Um, I feel like there was someone who might have been more cold in the situation, might have been more mean in the situation. Um, but they definitely were planning. They didn't know. They wanted happiness with a person um, that was not very warm to them. I feel like they were planning to be with this person, uh, but this person might have been detached. Um, a lot of this, a lot of these um, Gemini's could have had their happiness and their future blocked by a person who intervened as well. Okay, Spirit, why is the Ace of Spears here in reverse? Yeah, I feel like there was they an energy of growing restless in a situation. I definitely feel like um, there was a situation that was very burdensome um, that they grew tired of that was really stressing them out. Spirit, please. Yeah, a lot of um, a lot of Gemini's could have been having a lot of responsibilities on their shoulder, um, but I feel like um, there was a burden that they were carrying around. A lot of them had a burden. You know, they could have loved one person and been connected to another person. Um, one person could have came in between their future plans, is what I'm also seeing. Um, but there was a burden that um, they were carrying around that led to the disillusion of a third party situation or a person that they were happy with. Yeah. Some of them could have been connecting with a Scorpio. What's up Scorpios? But I feel like um 
Spirit, please clarify. A lot of them could have ended something in order to allow something to begin. Why is a death card here, Spirit? Yeah, I feel like there was definitely a, a situation here. What's up, Tauruses? Um, but I feel like it was a long-term commitment, a long-term relationship, or a marriage that they could have been burdened by, um, that they let go in order to go towards a new beginning. Um, and some of them could have went towards a third-party situation as well, okay? With the Ace of Cups here and the King of Spears and Temperance, I feel like right now this Gemini is... Um, you know, I don't feel like they're being emotionally fulfilled right now. I feel like they have some sort of emo emotional loss that they're they're facing. I feel like they're really analyzing this. Um, they're really trying to think with their head over their heart as to what they could have done differently or what went wrong in the situation. But I feel like right now um, they're trying to become more disciplined. They're trying to seek out what the truth is in the situation. And I feel like they're being patient. What's up, Sagittarius is, but I feel like they're being patient in the situation. They want something to balance out. They're willing to wait. Okay, they're analyzing. They're willing to wait until everything balances out. Um, so if you guys are connecting with the Gemini, you know, currently, whether you are with them or in a third party situation, I feel like this, this Gemini is trying to balance out a situation. They're analyzing what they need to do because they don't feel emotionally fulfilled right now. Okay. <clears throat> Spirit, please clarify Ace of Cups in reverse. Why is this here? Yeah. Um, what's up, Capricorns? But a lot of them um, might be bound to another situation. I'm definitely getting the sensation here that many of you are cross-watching with a Gemini who is attached to a person. If that's not it, they could be facing some sort of addiction, um, some sort of vice, something that they're bound to. Spirit, please clarify the devil. Why is this here? And a lot of them are getting married. You know, it could be a marriage, a fiance, a long-term commitment, um, a happy home life <clears throat> that is maybe happy because of money or for all the wrong reasons. But I don't feel like they're happy there. Yeah, they have the nice car. They have a beautiful house. All the pictures look good on Instagram, on Facebook, whatever. It's toxic. They're fronting, right? Spirit, please clarify King of Spirits. Why is this here? Yeah, a lot of them are tied to a situation and they're trying to figure out how to release the situation, how to untie themselves from the situation. They're stuck in a situation and they're trying to take a new perspective and how to get out of the situation. You know, they're hanging in the air. Spirit, clarify the hangman. Why is this here? Woo, too many. Spirit, please clarify the hangman. Why is this here? Yeah, they're planning. I feel like they're planning um, right now. They're definitely planning something. They're planning for their future. I feel like they're trying to figure out what path they want to go. Um, they're looking ahead right now. And because right now they're currently not happy and they want to move on from this energy is what I'm feeling. So whatever they're tied to, they're not happy in and they want to move. Um, they want to move out of this house. They want to move out of the relationship. They want to move, okay? Spirit, why is the temperance here? Yeah, a lot of them are want to offer their love to a person, but they're waiting for the right time. Spirit, why is the Page of Cups here? Yeah, there's legalities there. It could be a marriage. Um, there could be a lease. There could be shared finances. There's some sort of legalities. I cannot talk. My English is so bad. <laughs> There's some sort of legalities that they're trying to balance out right now. Okay, they're you know they're working on paperwork. They're looking at what their rights are. They're studying up on something. Okay, they're being patient in a situation. I feel like right now, um, all they have is memories. I feel like luck is not on their side. They feel like whatever avenue avenue they have come down, um, they have come or try to explore. They keep running into roadblock or a dead end. But I feel like whatever, whoever's inquiring about this Gemini, they're thinking about you. They're reflecting on you and all the good memories you had. You know, a lot of you had good times together. You know, real deep conversations, shared a beer together. Um, but with Ten of Cups, they're not emotionally fulfilled. And this is why they're 
always thinking about you. They're always reflecting on you, okay? So let's get some clarity here. Spirit, please clarify the Wheel of Fortune and reverse wise this here. Yeah. See, a lot of them think it's not fair because they are stuck in an unstable home environment. A lot of them are stuck in an unstable home environment that's not balanced out. They're not happy there. Um, they don't have support. They don't feel like anyone's supporting them. There's a lot of home conflicts there. Um, and with the King of Cups, you know, they're a nice person and they don't want to speak up. Okay. Um, but they do, they don't want to speak up in regards to love and they don't want to um, take that stand, you know, where they, they need to. So, yeah. See, I feel like a lot of them are reflecting on you cross watchers of Gemini and I feel like they haven't closed out a cycle with you there's a lot of unfinished business there there's a lot of baggage that has not been addressed and I feel like they're really reflecting on you and they have not moved on from you spirit please clarify six of yeah but they're being patient they're waiting on the right time um they're waiting on the right time right now I feel like they do want to come towards you they want to balance things they want to make things right but they're waiting on the right time with the Ten of Cups in reverse, again, they're not emotionally happy right now. Spirit, please clarify Ten of Cups. Yeah, I feel like this person wants to just bounce. They want to leave a situation. They want to go see what else is out there, but they can't because they're being restricted. They're being very analytical. They know that if they just go to another situation, it's not going to be right. It's not going to work out. It's not going to be stable. But they're trying to go the stable approach. Um, you know, this this air sign, this Gemini is trying to do this right thing. They're trying to be analytical. They're trying to analyze what is the correct step. You know, what can I do to get towards the person I love, you know, without it ruining that relationship and without me having to deal with the ex person or the person that I'm with is what I'm feeling. All right, Spirit, what messages do we have for the cross watchers in regards to love? In regards to life, in regards to the situation, what are the messages for the cross watchers of Gemini? What messages do you have for the cross watchers of Gemini in regards to love, in regards to life, or in regards to the situation? We have transformation, positive time in your life. Undergoing change for the better. Experience are transforming you. You will view challenges very positively. Success to follow. Rebirth, balance, psychic talents discovered. So a lot of you could be going through some sort of transformation. And this is for the best. Um, you know, just whatever you guys feel that's coming towards you, accept it, embrace it. A lot of you could be psychic and you don't know it. Whatever, just always remember that the transformation brings in a rebirth, okay? So this is beautiful. What else do the cross watchers need to know? Be alert. You may find yourself a victim because of another person's jealousy or dishonesty. Be alert. Situation now calls for clarity. Pay attention while driving and to details. Okay, you guys. So if you are on your cell phones when you're driving, please pay attention. But for others of you, I feel like this Gemini is being very cautious because the person that they with is very jealous, okay? They're dealing with a very jealous person, um, and I I feel like this is why they're being very patient. They're looking at all their you know all their rights, all their choices, because they don't want you to get hurt any further. So you know if there's a reason, I feel like they one reason could be I feel like they're protecting you as well. So just be you know don't push the situation. If this Gemini needs space, give them space. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and ease up the tension here. <laughs> Let's go ahead and cut the tension. Uh, what messages do you have for the cross watcher of Gemini? Ooh, too many. Cross watcher of Gemini, please. It says time to let go, move the fuck on. So if you guys feel that, you know, it's what you've done what you've done, you've done in this relationship, and then it's time to let go. Um, but what I'm taking from this is just really focus on yourself. This person is battling a situation, and I perceive it to be very karmic. Um, you can't put your life on the back burner. You know, you have to focus on yourself. Um, and this person, 
it will give them more um, reason to cut off this toxic partner and to go after their happiness, okay? And it says love. Get some, give some, it will cheer your ass up. And you're going through some tough shit. Everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up and handle it. Yeah. You guys can handle anything, okay? <laughs> it says they broke your heart. Fuck them. I didn't mean to pull that one, but I'll just leave it there for those that this resonates with. <laughs> All right. What other messages do we have for the cross watcher of Gemini? Merchant. Okay, so a lot of you need to focus more so on business. Um, if you guys are thinking about selling something, now's the time to do it. But a lot of you need to focus on um, areas of business, especially if you're in sales. Um, I feel like a lot of you, it will help you to get your mind off this person. Um, but just remember to focus on yourself. What other messages, please, Spirit? It says surprise. Yeah. Okay. So a lot of you, you might be a, get a surprise and hear from this person or find that when you focus more so on business, things are starting to go your way. Um, focusing on your, your pentacles, on your coins, on your money. Okay. Um, but right now you guys need to realize that a lot of you could be finding some money as well. Okay. But for the most part, I feel like you guys need to focus on yourself and let this person hash out this connection that they're with because I feel like a lot of them, like I said, are going through a karmic situation. And I feel like you guys can't change it. They have to do it. Okay? And if this person really cares for you, Crosswatcher, if this person really values you, I feel like they will do the right thing. Now, everyone's situation is different. So, again, if this person has children or, you know, they're married, it's not going to be easy. You can't just hash out those things overnight. You have to worry about finances. You have to worry about custody. You have to worry about, you know, leases, mortgage, everything, all the paperwork, car notes, everything. So it's not an easy thing. And this is why people stay in terrible relationships is because, you know, it's hard to leave. You know, who will take care of the children? Um, who will pay for this? Who will pay for that? So you really have to reevaluate the situation. You have to reassess the situation. You know, if you want this person all I can tell you is to focus on yourself. You can't wait for them. You can love them from afar. Um, you know, if they, they already know how you feel about them, love them from afar. That's it. That's all you can do. But don't let this person have you while they're still in a toxic situation. Because if they have you while they are in a toxic situation, then they're going to get used to you having you whenever they want you and not leave. Okay? So, Gemini's... Oh, uh, Gemini's. Oh my gosh. Okay. So cross watchers, I'm going to leave it here. I wish you the best. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch you on your next cross watcher video. Love. Take care.